that's a lash. I had to do it. I got it. This is the new Huda Beauty One Coat Wow. I'll be shocked if this works for me because my lashes are in big trouble lately. I tried a new lash serum and I don't like it. I like the color. Let's see. Convex. <laughs> Where's my schooling? Convex, concave. So I'm going to do the convex side first. I hope you guys can see. So far, so good. I like the brush, actually. It's not getting messy on my lid. Now I'm gonna turn it around and comb it through. I feel like the comb just took some of it off. Okay, let's go again. I have a feeling this I will be better because that was my first go. Yeah, see, there's a lot more product on the brush this time. Can you see it? I can see it. Oh, I forgot to curl this one. Silly me. All right, that's one coat. I'm gonna do a second coat and see what happens as I would with any other mascara. Okay, let's comb it out. Does anybody remember dial a lash? Was it Maybelline that had that? Where you could have it at one and it would be nice and natural and then you could dial it right up to 10 and you would have a really thick, crazy lash like this. You know what, like I'm a mascara girl so I don't mind the look of that. They look substantial now. My lashes feel heavy. <laughs> okay, comb it out. I actually really like it. I don't know if I'd wear it every day, but I like the fullness that it gave me, but that's my style. I'm not afraid of makeup and I don't mind if people see my makeup. I definitely have a very full lash and yeah, I kind of like it. I'm back being a teenager again. This mascara is definitely for mascara lovers. It's not gonna be for everybody, that's for sure. Let me know if you've tried it or if you're going to buy it and let me know what your favorite mascara is. I hope this helps and I will see you later. Bye.